YouTube. <laughs> so today what we're gonna do is um, we're gonna tint the front window of my truck I know I tinted the back window before but I'm gonna I, I've been driving around here in Jersey I know it's illegal but um I've been seeing a lot of people driving around with a front uh, window tinted so why not tint mine right so the tools you need is um basically you're gonna need a bunch of um, microfiber towel we need a different type of a squeegee and a blade, of course. We need um, we need actual film for tinning. You need a heat gun. You need a scissor, uh, scotch tape. You need a Windex and your soapy dish water. And before we start, what we wanted to do is grab your um, Windex fiber towel. <laughs> In and out. Side the edge.
done. Is this enough? We don't want no small particle. We don't want no small particle or dust or any lint to be get caught in a uh, inside a film and in between films and window. We want to make sure it's dust free, it's lint free, and super clean. Build them off and you're gonna scotch tape. Two pieces of scotch tape because it's gonna be hard to peel this off. So, what you wanted to do is pick it one from the other side, one from the other side that way. It's time to go, and then I don't know what happened. Are you supposed to be good at this? Remember? Hold that piece. Just like that. Just like that. Uh, this is the hard part. We gotta slide that in to that window gasket. Tuck it in, tuck it in. Okay. Now that we are tucked in, this is not good because we're actually tinting under the sun. I'm supposed to do it in the shade, but um, I don't know. I don't know why I'm doing it like this. It's not supposed to be like this. Okay. Let me dry it up pretty quick. There we go. Move it around. Move it around. You see that gap? We're just gonna do it like this. I think that's a perfect gap for me. All right, now get our squeegee once again. Get a, get both of the squeegee. Spray the soapy water so we won't scratch the plastic. Go, squidgy it out, side by side. Whoop, this thing got moved, we're gonna push it down a little. 
See those bubbles, right? Push it out. How's it looking out there? Uh, good. So basically this window doesn't have that much curve. That's why we didn't heat it up that good outside. We didn't even heat it up at all. Right? Yeah. Because it doesn't have that much curve. So what we're gonna do is go wipe this down. This is the top is basically squeezed up. So what we wanted to do. Let's just double check it. I don't want no water. No, it looks clean. No more bubble. Make sure we don't have no bubble because you don't want to end up having a bubble in your window. So that looks clean. So roll it up. You no know, rolled up all the way. No bubbles at all, which is good. Now we're gonna work our way down now here. Push everything down. I'm pretty sure this is gonna have fingers. You call that little thing sticking out, that, that thing called fingers. <sighs> Push everything out. everything down all of it nothing left behind all of it Let's swipe it off and see Let's do inspection so what you want it to do when you think you're done you want it to wipe it down like this all right Wipe it down. Oh, I see finger coming up. You see this finger? Come look close. See that? That's what we call finger. Push that down. Good thing we're sitting under the sun. The sun driving up the drying up the film quick. Curing the film onto that glass. Alright? Okay. Look clean, no bubble, no bubbles. There's a little water trapped in here, push it down. Push everything down. Don't be afraid to uh, stuff water inside your door because inside the door is getting wet every time it rains. window is done check it out check it out check 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 it out mm -hmm. Cut. 